Uh, how are we going, Lion? We're going all right. I've had my morning coffee. I think I might need another one before this stream is done. <laughs> I woke up, did my morning routine, heeded the call of nature, just shat, shat, shat the, literally shat the, scrolling through Discord, watching a potential argument unfold, going, God, I need coffee. <laughs> Jenny Demonic was better as a book. Haven't read the book. Does it have anything quite as wonderful as tighter. Keanu Reeves yelling about them. room service in a junkyard? Avoid those turrets. They're deadly. What about my spectral field? The core is protected by much more sophisticated sensors. I'm afraid automatic camouflage can only get us so far. They can see me. They can see everything. Uh, wait. So nothing. So nothing. I wasn't expecting a bit of stealth in my crazy runner game. Boop. Gosh darn it. Gonna have to go that way. Ah, no, they're gonna fire on me. Ah, shit. We're good. We're good. We're fine. We're fine. No I problem. Kind of similar, you and I. How? Your romance isn't even better. Book. I love your romance. <clears throat> I've got the uh, the sprawl trilogy. The I've read the sprawl trilogy. The it our it kind of falls off a bit after we the first book, but fight. I quite like it. I quite like it. Sure, you did. Everyone does, one way or the other. Oh no, I totally had that, come on. So yeah, one, one of the criticisms of this that is uh, gestating in my mind is that there is such a fine line between what counts as a grab, what counts as contact on certain things in this game. But the thing that kind of makes it less annoying is the quick restarts. The super quick restarts, the real generous checkpointing, that kind of stuff. The core used to house Dharma's technological and administrative centers. Now, it's a grim ruin. It's painful to see my city in such a state of decay. But I've learned my lesson. I won't underestimate Mara again. I like Count Zero. Mona Lisa Overdrive is a little... I was already active when Mara killed Adam. I'd love to see adaptations. I would love, love, love to see adaptations. I just don't want them to fuck it up. I'm sure William Gibson doesn't want them to fuck it up either. Ah. Though Johnny Mnemonic does have a few things going for it. It's got a, uh, a cyberspace dolphin hacker. It's got Beat Takeshi. As a Yakuza gangster overlord. It's got ice, ice tea or ice cube. Can't remember which one it is. It's one of the ices. It's one of the ice clan. Right now, you're traversing the exclusion zone. No civilians are allowed beyond here. There are only rumors about the Keymaster's vast laboratory. I've heard she does some terrifying experiments there. I've even heard she sometimes throws people outside. Yep. Out of the labs. No, outside. Out of the tower. Probably to watch them die. Into the cursed wasteland. What is this, Mega City 1? We actually playing a, a Judge Dread game? A drug addict size cyberspace hacking dolphin, yes. But yeah, the first book is <clears throat> perfect. Yeah, come on. Do the jump. There we go. Oh wait, I didn't kill him. I thought Blink would get him. Never mind.
you get a shadow run feel from this. Never played it. Line, you did say Mega City One last uh, stream. Ah, I must have missed you saying that. No, oh, not quite. Yeah, 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 he knows it. He knows I'm coming for you. And then I die. Fudge. Alright, let's try that again. I had it so smooth on that one run. Referencing the tabletop RPG. Uh, uh. I repeat, I've never played either. <laughs> I've heard a lot. I can deflect those bullets back at them, but my timing is off. This is why I need another coffee. Dang it! Because say hey! How's it going? Oh, what? That wasn't a deflect? Then again, I'm not using that module. Oh, yeah, I'm not using it. Never mind. He's supposed to clean at home, but your cat is fluffy and you want to cuddle. Yink. Almost to stream every day this week. Appreciate it. It's nice sometimes. Break out from the usual editing routine I have. I think the trouble for me is gonna find... Is how to find a way to... Ah, fudge. Integrate all of this into my... Yeah. YouTube editing routine. Or can I ideally have a bit of both? Oh no! Where am I? I'm surprised I hadn't died yet. A lot of people have mentioned Katana. I do see the parallels. The heck? The heck? Evil Gamer 23 months, thank you so much! How you doing this morning? Afternoon? Evening? Ah, okay, he's not looking at me this time. So something I've noticed is, like, the positioning we of these guys the isn't always constant. Even if the keys didn't stop us, we'd have never made it through. We were right to count on your help, though. If you succeed, all the climbers will not have died in vain. I will. Uh, 
Morning gear, 4.45 a.m. Gosh. 9.42 here. Give it a second. Not quite return to coffee o'clock. Just yet. Getting the timing. There we go. What? He blinked through the the crate. Yeah, there's ever there's there's some like sour notes of jank throughout the course of this game. It's not perfect. When it works, it's beautiful. When it starts getting a bit weird, it's like. Uh, uh. God, I can't get through those guys' shields. No. Guys, I'm gonna have to do it without the freaking power up, or I could get it again. That works as well. Yep. Missed. Oh, you can get through it after multiple throws. Okay. Oh, is there a secret in here? Yes. Oh, is that a new blade? I'll go on that. That that fits. That's fit. That fits me very nicely. She. I shouldn't have fucked with those guys because now I've got to do the entire section from the start. I love how they attack me one at a time like that. Very, very convenient. Sometimes they really weirdly whiff the shots. Very strange. Hotline Miami in its uh, repetitive gameplay. It's all about just um, practice until you get it right. Right, 
to these fuckers. I don't know why they're giving me so much, uh, so much trouble. You know what I might do? I might deal with- actually I can't deal with the melee because they're shielded. So what I might do instead is save my Tempest. Break that. Get rid of one of them. Yeah. Alright, where's that pass through? It gives me the shuriken. This is a bollock of an area. It really is. kind of game that dominates your attention. You have to be entirely focused on it. Okay. These guys. It's just these two guys. Are starting to really annoy me. I don't want to. I want to deal with them before I have to deal with these. But uh, Again, I could try and use this on these two guys. Oh, I can't. You can only use one at a time. Shit. I run out of dash charges. That's what it is. Those two guys are making you think about the arches on the roof in Dark Souls. <laughs> Maybe, maybe I should fiddle with my upgrades. So what, what gave me that extra dash charge? Dash charge 2. Cooldown is significantly increased. Dash gains one additional, but its cooldown is increased. That one it isn't. Ah, because it takes up more space. So I'd probably have to get rid of maybe Surge. Don't really care so much about Surge. And um, what can I fit in here? Enemies visible through walls, tactical overlay, sensory boost, blink range, tempest. Hmm. Aim boost. Let's just use that. Now I get two dash charges, which should make up for my inadequacy when it comes to dodging feckin' bullets. Nope. 
come on. Oh no, I throws me off completely when they whiff their own bloody sword swipes. So to master the upgrade section, you gotta be good at Tetris. Yes, but it's worth your while to leave a few slots open. Because that allows your charge to re recharge. That allows your focus to recharge quicker. What the fuck is that window? Sometimes it feels if you're not aiming dead at them, they'll just fuck you. Hey, ding dong, they're finally dead. Alright, so I've got... <laughs> this section's a slog. Right, I don't get why I can't slide. There you go. It's just the window is so narrow. So, things I can go for first. I can go the shuriken, but I'm already face first with these guys. And then I gotta do this, and then the wall run doesn't quite work. And then... Oh god, come on. Why do they turn so quickly? Get up there. Just, just slice the fucker. It's so awkward this section. I knew this had deathmatch. Right. How to deal with this section with the shields? Why isn't this fucking shuriken working the way I imagine it should? I don't get it. I know they're shielded, but it's basically a homing weapon. You don't really have to be dead on aiming. Just, you just need to have that open window of opportunity to hit them. Games like these are fucking catnip to speedrunners. <laughs> you wanna buy the soundtrack? I'm sure you'll be able to get the soundtrack separate at some point. See, that's what's supposed to happen. You get behind him. And then that happens. Oh no, I just find the setup of this little bit here really, really irritating. Oh, why isn't it doing the thing? Ugh. We're approaching the oldest part of Darla Tower. This is my seat of power long before the burst. This works. Up until I was betrayed. It's time to reclaim this place. Left of it. Hmm. 
Wait a minute. Yeah, I don't have to go around there at all. I received a distress signal on a frequency only used by the climbers. I I have to check it out. It's a trap. What if it's not? It's a trap. There's somebody out there that needs my help. I can't ignore them. I won't let you fight our war while I hide. No, you don't. It was nice of you to pretend to you. But we both know you're fine on your own. Do you have a weapon? I do. Thank you for everything you've done for us. I hope that we meet soon, and that we'll all be free when that happens. Goodbye, Jack. Goodbye. Okay, goodbye, Jack. <laughs> ah, no. Goodbye. Goodbye. Zoe out. Okie dokie. She probably won't survive. But if we fail, nobody will. Even if we remove Mar, the tower will still be riddled with the crime and corruption she brought about. What do you mean? I mean, saving humanity will take more than just killing the tyrant. It will require iron resolve in a single unit. Imagine there was a secret up there. I could live without it. I can live without it. Ugh. It's all about the satisfaction when you nail it. True, true. But you want the mechanics that lead up to it to ultimately make you feel like you're doing that perfect, smooth, flowing run. But more often than not, it's kind of a flailing <laughs> run that, that gets you through. <laughs> Regrettably, most of humanity's history and culture is forever lost. Mara didn't care about such things. The only science she wanted was her own research. She had no idea how to run the tower. Watching your stream inside of VR chat smile. Damn, I wish I had a VR headset. What was her goal? Change. I hope it's cool. She took it upon herself to <laughs> Thank you for humanity. two months. You'll see for yourself soon enough. It was definitely a creepy thing here. And a secret. Oh, is that a new sword skin? Yes, please. I like that one. Alright, I get the feeling there's gonna be a shuriken power up somewhere. Yes. But of course there is. Alright, where exactly do I go after that bit? I don't know. Have you ever played Alien Vanguard? Yes. Once upon a time. I'm getting on a bit now, aren't I? Yeah. Alright, so maybe... Maybe... Maybe, maybe, maybe... Don't use that, that, that hook. Oh, don't use that wall run there. Plus, the thing you got to consider with these is they take a certain amount of time to recharge whatever they're connected to, so you got to do them in a particular order. So, imagine your disappointment when you couldn't put on a... Uh, when you was on a spooky stream, but couldn't use my Skelly Boy, because your subscription expired, so he is to 34 months. I imagine that's... that's in the go. Oh, sugar, I ran out of charge. That's what I'm talking about. There's bounces in my tip cup. Hey, look at them go. <laughs> Let them have the fun. And then we go through here. Yep. That noise. Mara the Keymaster will now address the residents of the tower. That's unexpected. Why? She doesn't do speeches. Never been much of a leader. It's been a long time since I've talked to you. Too long. 
Some of you seem to have forgotten me. Oh, I don't think they have. Oh yeah, it was 12 hours ago that you did the resub server. I, I thought it was going to come through now. <laughs> but now you can use the Skelly Boy as much as you like. I like Mr. Bubs. The demonic dog. Hmm. Very ominous. Very ominous indeed. Also wondering what exactly I'm doing here. Miss something? Oh, it does give me the. <laughs> it does give me the mounting animation when I try and do that. Am I missing something super obvious? I probably am. Breaking. My videos have been a highlight over the past five years. Thank you so much. Much appreciated. I'm just floundering in my own particular niche <laughs> somewhere in the depths of YouTube. <laughs> I'm glad I'm glad at least some people get a kick out of them. Alright, it must be this. It must be this big old glowing screen. No. No, the guide with light principle isn't quite um working yet. Oh! Is it just me, or is that a really awkward position for a Switch to be in, in, in just any room in general? I know it's supposed to point directly to the door that you've opened, but... That does not... Nothing in here leads the eye. You frequently go back to watch the uh, Doom Mower video. <laughs> I enjoyed making that. I'm not here to woo you. I'm here to save you. The outside world is harsh and deadly. And it's not going to change. Not anytime soon. Bollocks. Bollocks. I do appreciate that it lets you wall run on any given surface, just not, you know, predefined surfaces. We can't alter the planet, but we can alter ourselves. That is nonsense. The fuck are you? How am I supposed to deal with you? Yeah. Entirely artificial respiratory system. Synthetic grass covering 80% of the body. No brains to speak of. This is Mars' solution. And what's yours? Oh. Like I told you. What am I doing? I'm resolved. How much is this on early access? It's not early access. It's not. Single will, one purpose. It's a full release. Have you not looked it up on Steam or anything? We need to adapt. To evolve. Technology kept us alive until now. Gave us this shelter. But we need to take it in deeper. Into our bodies. Uh, uh, that also works. I think I'm gonna get really annoyed with these things. Real early. Under 
everyone will be enhanced. Soon, we'll inhabit the outside once more. Nope. Nope, not, not enjoying these enemies. Not enjoying them. They've, they've all got explosives on the back and they suck. Alright, so, so is there any conventional way for me to deal with these? Other than running away from them, because I think if I just slash them, they blow up. Yeah. Gotta avoid them. At least they don't fly. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> mm. What did I do right last time? Honestly. Oh, you gotta wait. That's a thing. You gotta wait for him. I feel like sometimes that's the antithesis of certain gameplay design things in this game. There's certain points where it wants you to hurry up and wait. Ever so slightly. When most of the, most of the time it's all about forward momentum. It's within our power to set ourselves free. Yeah, it's literally running. It's within our power to set ourselves free. No, nah, not interested. Fuck it. Much rather avoid him. What? Did the ninja kill those crawlers? I don't think so. I think I've got to line him up as best I can. Uh, either that or get him to explode in a way that doesn't kill me. Which is really difficult to kind of juggle when you've got this first person perspective. I felt like some kind of progress. The key has already been forged. All we need to do is turn it. But this will not Fuck. happen if we are divided. Alright. He's still alive. He might have killed him. But then he killed me. So fuck that guy. Oh, so freaking small to do anything. Some areas work, some areas don't. The Dark Souls of Fruit Ninja. I think that reference hurt my brain. Oh, 
Oh, come on! Needs to be tighter. It needs to be tighter. That's what it is. Dad, my patience levels are at all-time high. <laughs> Based on the last few years. You gotta know... How to... Efficiently release your tensions. Wait. It's still here. It's still here. She must have missed its function. She must have missed its function. The auxiliary servants. You know what to do. Might be our best find yet. Okay, let's hope this doesn't crap the stream like last time. The cyber void um, just almost ruined the stream <laughs> yesterday. I had to take it down and then um, bring it back up, but it seems to be working alright. Hideous Destructor prepares one for plan. For Parenthood confirmed, yes. Ugh. A singular opportunity. The technique you'll learn here is beyond what regular Ghost Runners were ever capable of. Regular? We weren't equal? Equal? Yes. Identical? No. Some of you had unique abilities. Some had experimental features. Mm. Well, considering I'm about to acquire upgrade number four of four, I'm, I'm thinking I'm quite near the end of the game. Oh, it's 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 visually fantastic. I can't fault it for that, Tango. What about me? What about you? What were my unique abilities? You didn't have any, I'm afraid. Pro tip, don't press jump on the jump pads. The one destined to become so very... They'll work on their own. Special. This does have RTX, by the way. Just in case you were wondering. <laughs> it's got a lot of shiny surfaces. We've been through that already. You were peacekeepers. My elite... No, before that. Before the implants. There was no before. You weren't born. You were engineered from a single cell up. You don't have implants. You are your implants. Of course! I'm just going with the flow in this level at the moment. The only one who hears a bit of Duke Nukem in the protagonist's voice. I hear a little bit of, um... Steve Blum. Bit of, bit of Spike Spiegel. From Cowboy Bebop, if you don't know. Now you can't unhear Steve Blum. <laughs> Met him in person, Drake. I heard he's a he's a pretty chill guy, nice guy. I also uh, watch a lot of Racevic on YouTube whenever he uploads. He's someone who sounds very similar to Steve Blum. Ah, uh, yay, yay. Yeah. Unfortunately, you can't wall run in these sections, which is a bit of a pisser. 
And because the non-Euclidean, it gets uh, a little, a little, a little confusing. I'm sure you've noticed I've been running in circles. Is this background music in game? Yes. Yes, it is. It's a good soundtrack. What's the technique? You remember the Atma chip the girl used? Brain interfaces. Yes. There's a way to exploit them. Send a control signal deep into the neural cortex. You learned how to hack people. If that's what you want to call it. <sighs> but for the most part, I, I don't mind these as... Breaking the pace of the Won't game. Mara try to use this exploit. No, but there's a few won't. of these sections that she are just. Know it exists. Well, I one in particular that's just not the very way she defeated you. I guess we both kept our little secrets. That was last stream. It involved a rotating hallway. It kind of sucked. You just got done with the demo? Impressive. Hoi. Welcome to like the back end of the game. So, yeah, spoilers. Right. Swap that back. This ways. Cross my fingers that it lands me in the right place. It does not. But I've already been. Brain. Oh, I wasn't counting the lanterns at all. That makes perfect sense. That's a nice hint there. That's a nice hint. I just wasn't paying attention at all. I, I have not had anywhere near enough coffee. So I need a five. I need that thing. But I need to find a three. Which is that. It's because I picked the wrong direction last time. Eh. 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 God, God, I am so smart. S-M-R-T. Super smart. Do you owe me an apology? No, that was a very helpful hint. That that was the actual helpful hint. You 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 sussed that I was flailing a bit, and you pointed out something interesting about the level, which caused me to take an interest in those particular aspects. And yeah, you, you did a good job. You did a good job. The software update is complete. Uh, so thank you. Smurt. No, SMRT. I am now, so smart. Try it out. Find their center. Let the implant speak to you. Ah, oh, yeah. So you can just make them friendly. Cool beans. Pick your target wisely. Not every pawn is going to be worth the effort. Just like that. This is actually quite tricky to simulate. You're worse than Mara. What are you talking about? She sabotaged the ghost rings. You did it to everyone. It's a tool. If you don't like it, don't use it. Hmm. 
Yimk, has England gone back down into lockdown? Oh, oh. Oh, boy. If that ain't a kettle of fish with regards to, to how the fuck any of this works. So, um, as many of you are probably finding out across the world, your government is probably amazingly incompetent. Unless you live in New Zealand, in which case, you lucky son of a bitch. Um... <laughs> So we have got a three-tier system depending on the region and how high the infection rate is or reinfection rate. You have three different tiers. The top tier is the highest. You gotta generally stay indoors, but pubs are still open. I don't. I don't know. Schools stay open. Things. It's it's stupid. It's 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 really poorly conceived. This is most governments in general. Basically, what they've been trying to get people to agree on is whether we should just have a big fat national lockdown like we did earlier in the year and just, you know, knock it on the head. Yes, I am in favor of that. In fact, where I live, actually, like one postcode over from where I live, they are bringing in the army to do um like bulk testing of everyone regardless of whether they're symptomatic or not now it's voluntary the army is just helping in a in a logistical capacity but it's like oh why didn't you just do this to begin with just blanket test absolutely fucking everyone because some people are asymptomatic and then we can get a better idea of it basically there is such a lack of leadership in this fucking country there's no desire to grab the bull by its horns and just say let's deal with this shit there's a lot of buck passing and it annoys the shit out of me <laughs> which is why i don't tend to talk about it all that much But yeah, that, that 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 there's there's my there's my hot take on the, on my particular view of the situation. Maybe wedge something in that slot. Technique boost. Mm, hard me. Yeah, that'll work. I don't have to fill all the slots. Login. Log from Blamo, uh, government isn't just incompetence, it's just criminally negligent. Potato. Potato. Ugh. Those incapable of making the effort took up arms against us. We had to defend our future, and we did. The traitors are dead, but their supporters still walk among us. Mustache. I'll read that in a sec. Ay, ay, ay. If lock up. If lock up and government issues we're talking about here in Israel, we're getting ready to get out of the second lock up, and the things going on here, I think we'll find ourselves in the third. Yeah. Yeah. You, you get the sense that a lot of people just are tired of the wishy-washiness of everything. I mean, I've got family members that are planning on just saying fuck it at Christmas time. <laughs> and then driving up. You know, even if they can't come into the house. You know, they got a grandkid that they want to see. Oh god, why is my frame rate gone choppy? Alright. 
Alright, 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 alright. Ah, come on, there's my charge. Nope. Oh, fudge. Ninja, good, 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 good. But basically, those mouth-breathing living bombs are just there to put pressure on you in any given area in order to keep moving. But I, I, I hate them. If we don't want to lose our dream, we must act on it. I'm not the sure if I hate them we won't in a. Uh, how, how dare I have to deal with a bit of additional challenge, right? Or if I hate them in a, I don't think it's fun game design. Either way, it's opinion. Oh, hey, it's my room. No. <laughs> no. What a, what a definitive statement. Ah, Righto! Oh, I didn't realize he was a machine gunner. Feel like you're one step from martial law. I'm sure I like the wrinkle that those living bombs bring into this. Not dead. Have I not killed all of them? 
Pretty sure I killed all of them. Nope, nope, the gateway isn't open. He's still alive. That fella. What does it mean? It means he wants to turn everyone into abominations. Replace half their bodies with her insane tech. I mean, I don't have to deal with you. Just... Oh, wait, no, I do have to deal with you. <sighs> Some enemies in this. But it's just like, huh? So other than T he he chase me, what am I de what am I achieving here? There we go. You just, you just gotta chase him till he slows down. Okay. It's not the same as the okay. Ghost Runners. Why not? She was working with me then. Whee. Uh, back on that. There we go. Friendly. Oh god, there's two of the fuckers. Oh, what? What even hit me? Ah. But I think you spent two months in Nor Norwegian jail. It takes a moment to read this. You want to become a criminal? Jail is the best place to tie some new bonds. It's like a vacation colony for adults with seven hours paid work, crappy free food, exercise TV, and all the coffee you can shug. Boy. <laughs> it's got a Norway and commit some crime. Uh, nah, don't, do don't do crime. Don't do crime, kids. See, I don't mind these fellas in this configuration because I, I get the setup a lot more uh, clearly. Why, 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 why don't you grab back onto the thing? Is that a thing that you cannot do? Pa apparently not. Apparently you can't reattach to the thing. 
That's a bit of a pain in the ass. I feel like I take hits from out of nowhere sometimes. When I'm when I'm pretty sure I've cleared all of the other bits I need to be concerned about. Ay 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 ay. The imp can fortunately if you go to jail in South Africa be coming out with an anus hole bigger than the duck in Delta. Oh man. It's too early for that kind of descriptive statement. <laughs> oh boy. Come on. Okay. Now I can do the whole catch up business. Oh, they got All each other? Sweet. The Dharma Tower should report to their nearest Keymaster Guard Station and await further instructions. Residents who fail to comply will be contacted by officers of the Guard and escorted to the augmentation facilities. so well. Not sure what hit me there. Might have been a swipe from way over yonder. Yep. Loy has lore it's illegal for a moose to copulate with another moose on a public street. Good luck telling that to the moose. <laughs> yeah! I the moose would, um... Have a hard time giving a shit. I mean, have you seen how big moose... What's a plural for moose? Is it moose? Mooses? Where you going, buddy? He, where was he going? He was just hanging on the side for no good reason? You know what, let's go this way. Hey! All fun and games until someone gets cleaved in twain. show you death counting. Eh. I can't remember if it shows uh, during the end of chapter. No longer human. Mara must be stopped. Then we can play drinking games. Yeah, it says on the uh, on the end screen. Eighty seven deaths way. 
Hingis, first time you saw a moose close up, you thought, damn, I could probably drive under her belly with my car if she stood still. Second thought was probably, boy, that moose could probably fuck up my car if I attempted to drive <laughs> underneath it. Oh, boy. So the plural of moose is moose. Good to know. I don't know why I find that such an interesting fact. Language is funny. I'd say if you were going to do a drinking game, maybe um, every 10 deaths. Yeah, I much more appreciate the, like the, the pure parkour sections. When they're, when they're sprinkled in with a few more, um, you know, incidental enemies on the way. color monitoring devices but of course when are you gonna play hexmas christmas seasonal right I mean, they were shooting at me. This here, it's mercy killing. If it's not seasonal, Marissa, why is it called Hexmas? Like Christmas or Xmas with Hex in the miss? I know. I know. I get it. I get it. But it bothers me in 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 one of those. Anal retentive ones. I should have been looking for that. Oh, I did grab it. It's got a pretty wide field. Oh, there's one there as well. How did I not friggin' notice that the first time? I'm a dingus. First thing I'm doing when I'm entering an area here is just uh, trying to take note of the enemies I need to kill. Okay. 
dang it. I'm not very good at getting into the flow of this section, am I? How am I missing all of these people? with that fucking drop. Beamus? Beamus? Great. I should get one of those uh, 12 days of Christmas beer advent calendars. Alcohol every day. <laughs> Such a waste. Each one of them could have contributed to the town's future, be a useful tool in the making of humanity's redemption. A tool? Everyone's an instrument, something. No. Everyone's an instrument, something greater. Their master, their master. An ideal they hold dear, even their own ambition. That would have been a great section for just some random peon to be at that platform though for me to kill. That was pleasingly timed with the music for me. And that made me feel nice. Oh god, we got shielded bots. Ah. You as a David. Nah. <laughs> I mean, I've not gone to great pains to obscure that kind of information. Probably sure. Like how he can brag about being the architect for this building despite it being a death trap, even without the enemies. Well, yeah, he does go on about that. <laughs> when there's like the death trap elevator security. He's like, oh no, no, that's intentional. So you get the, uh, the first sense that, yes, this guy is yeah, very much an asshole. Hmm. 
another one around here. I'm sure of it. Where's he at? Sure, I heard. Oh, there's two. Never mind. for a second. Probably could have avoided those. Anyway. Every time I die from those robots, Metal Gear. Oh. I get it. Those are interesting. Once you suss that you can find out which one's real. How have I not added Snake saying Metal Gear to the soundboard yet? Because I just know it'll be spammed into oblivion. <laughs> By me! Deformation is not the worst of Mara's tortures. Their minds are even more disfigured than their bodies. Why would she do this? It's just a side effect. She doesn't care about their sanity, only about efficiency. But the human mind cannot survive in a body so far removed from its original form. What about your mind? Shit, where's my focus gone? Ah! Pick him, right? Take a breather. The architect is sarcasm. It reminds you of Malcolm from Jurassic Park. That's what I was aiming for.
You are not Adam. Nope. You are an abomination that he came to fear before he died. You are an abomination that he came to fear before he died. Before she killed him. Flawed as he was, you're far worse. Not a shred of conscience. No empathy. No soul. I mean, for all its flaws, this game does have some very satisfying moments in it. Gotta give it that. By no means... Uh, bad game! Though occasionally I am terrible at it. As I said in the, in the last stream. A few sour notes. Occasionally, uh... Mix a little poorly with the overall flavor. I can still make it. I can still make it. Up. That was a sour note right there. I feel like, uh, yeah, some some of the snapping. When it comes to surfaces, could be just a smidge more generous, you know? Uh. It does ever so slightly cross that line between You know, get good and wait, no. Some of that is bullshit. <laughs> See, the thing I hate about that is it's a blind... It's a blind end of the rail. The first time through, you've got precious little chance of knowing that that's coming up. Oh... No, nope, no, nope, way out for that. So. That was a little unfair, I had two of them to go up against that. They're all bundled together.
can I just get rid of these fuckers with them? That'd be nice. I don't think I got them. But that'll do. I got one of them. Oh, where's my hook? That was a waste of surge. Content, have a great weekend. You too. Take care. Son of a Sometimes the gambit works, sometimes it doesn't. It's a little... It's a little 50-50. Come on. Oh, is that guy still slashing at me? I could have got him. So let's ride that. Do that then. Come on. There's a way through these. Yeah, the timing. Oh, those freaking slashes! Should probably be invulnerable while riding those. I think that would just make it. out of the way and dodging that son of a bitch. I don't believe I'm doing anything specifically wrong in this encounter. It's just my timings. It's tight. Extremely tight timings. Maybe there should be an invulnerability window, I guess, when you first get on one of those things. Yeah, that's right. I'm gonna save my friggin' surge for the next guy. So I can get him from range. If I can get you out of that. There you go. And now I've got to deal with these. Oh wait, no. There's a dude still alive over there. That's gonna be Trixie. Yeah yeah. Soul. Ask a philosopher if you can manage to find one. A 
about that. If you're dead, not me. Ooh. One thing's been bothering me. Why did you protect Sector 5? Why risk your precious pawn instead of getting to me as soon as possible? Unless... It wasn't you who wanted to save them, but your puppet. It's got a will of its own now. Did you act... No reason to listen to her prattle on. She's just trying to sidetrack you again. Dang it! The place I want to be. Oh boy! Oh, there's platforms up top. See the guys down there. Maybe that's why they've got those um, outline implants in this. So it's easier to see certain foes in certain situations. Let's face it, we knew he was going to be shady all along. You will learn all the details once we deal with Mara. She is the only enemy, not just yours and mine. Humanities. So I'm going to guess that the Ghost Runners ended up being tools of oppression. I might even guess that Zoe the Climber may be a complete fabrication. Just to get him to play along. Mikoroy, Shadow Warrior 3. I'm looking forward to that. I'm looking forward to that. Since before the burst, I supervised First Sun Sarah Corporation and then Dharma Tower from here. My office was just around the corner. This is where you were conceived, so to speak. The design came together here, at my private workshop. Who am I? You are the perfect fusion of code and flesh. You are the next step. Who, not what? Ah, 
that doesn't make me go any faster. <laughs> I find sliding upstairs to be something amusing in video games. Wouldn't that be just hell on your knees? <laughs> Your time is running out. The augmentation process begins. Once it is done, the people of Dharma will be free, immune to your corruption, and no longer dependent on your prison. There is no salvation check out some inside the tower. Kind of spoiled for yourself. Our future lies outside. There Thanks for dropping by in any case. Here as well, naturally, but we'll pay it. A price indeed, humanity. Yeah, that looks comfortable. But yeah, Shadow Warrior. Quite enjoyed the first uh, new Shadow Warrior. Shadow Warrior Two, I had problems with. Uh, we'll, we'll see if they deal with them in Shadow Warrior Three. Metal Gear Solid 2 had you trip and stumble if you tried to dodge upstairs. Yes. One of the many touches that I love about MGS2. Uh, time to kill Doc Ock. So, do you even know what drives you, puppet? What the end game is? You have done nothing wrong, puppet, but I can't let you be. As long as that demon in your head exists. You are a threat to everything I've built. Alright. Let's see how this works. Focus. Kill switch or not. This is an opponent you cannot afford to take lightly. Oh, humanity shall endure without you. Not sure what that attack is. What it? Oh, is that just her arm going underneath the ground? Okay. Run oh. all you want. Uh, you gotta dodge it last second. Wondering where my attack window is. I get a little I get a little pissy about boss fights where it's all about waiting. Like you don't even have a chance of inflicting any kind of damage until, you know, the appointed the appointed moment. You can't keep it up. So it's less about skill and more about memorization. The best boss fights, in my opinion, blend both. Can I, can I block that incoming strike? I don't know what I'm doing. I think that's the biggest thing I can bring up about this. Sometimes I'm not sure what it wants me to do. I mean, I'd assume in some cases you could attack the arms. If I was designing this, I'd have moments where the arm slams down and you've got a temporary window. There you go, to wail on the arm, but it takes fucking forever for that opportunity to arrive. Oh, great. New wrinkle. Oh, at least it was a checkpoint. So, you've, have you got a maneuver? Does that happen at the same point each time? These, these are all questions. Okay. Don't make it harder for yourself. 
I still like this fight better than the, uh, the fight against Hell. This is at least more interesting than that fight. Adaptation is the only way! It's not quite a hesitation is defeat line, but hey hey. Can't all be separate. You waiting for the 10 minute speedrun video in front of us? <laughs> Taking bets on the boss rush? What, that a boss rush will happen in this? You just reminded me that Sekiro has a boss rush mode now. Which I'm tempted. I'm tempted to give a will, but I think I'd need to play through Sekiro all the way through again. I get that they want to have a big encounter, but they feel so... ...bogged down. I don't know what it is about them, they're just a little... There's not a lot of momentum to them. No sense of give and take. It's interesting that the only thing that truly makes this is the only way. a pain to deal with is the fact that you die in one hit. The telegraphing is is languid, I think is is uh, is how I'd describe it. It's like that um that, that final blow in a flurry from an enemy in Dark Souls where they take like 150 fucking hours to wind up that last attack and the, the window of where you're supposed to you know, dodge is way out. Having to adjust to that. As with many aspects of Ghost Runner, I feel like it could be tighter. I feel particularly, you know, all that butt hurt about this. It's just I'm kind of, I'm not, I'm not feeling very excited by it. Is what I'm, what I'm trying to get across. You know what would really help if those arms had like a little blinky red light on them just before the strike actually launches. That'd be satisfying. You know where it just has that ding? I see that attack. <laughs> Out the way. Mm. It just goes on a bit. <laughs> it just drags. This is just phase two as well. It probably doesn't help that I was dealing with the ridiculous intensity of Doom Eternal, the Ancient Gods, earlier this week. <laughs> it's uh, it's a bit of a it's a bit of a climb down. Unfair comparison, for sure. Don't 
Don't make it harder for yourself. Right, how do I get you to fuck up? Do I need you to... Yeah. How... Oh. How long do you reckon people, on average, would spend figuring that shit out? Because you gotta do all of that dodging. All of that memorization. And then you gotta remember that you need to have her strike one of the power conduits behind you. you kill me, puppet. Behind you. This boss was Sam. Sam. Sama made me hurt in a good way. I like to sweat in my boss battles. I do like to get good and sweaty, but, um... Yeah, there's gonna be that element of satisfaction. It's not a person. It's a machine stuck in a loop. Also, did, has her voice actress changed? <laughs> I don't know why she sounds different from, like, the previous... ...previous stuff I've been listening to. Alright, we gonna spin or what? Spin! What would you do if you kill me, puppet? But yeah, another game that certainly comes to mind is Fury. Boy, I love Fury. Fury is freaking great. I get that I'm... To... Yeah, I know what I'm saying, in fairness. You gotta remember, this is built on how many hours of me playing this, and... Right, okay, here's, here's, here's something for you to consider. Consider the following. A way for the game to signpost things that you should pay attention to has been the color yellow. For a big, fat stretch of this game. It's not a person, it's a machine stuck in a loop! Now we got blue. Can you see an inherent problem with using blue right now? I can. Also, there's the case of remembering which one of these conduits you've already smashed. Yeah, when it comes to games like these that rely on... It's not a person. It's ...snap decision-making... Yeah, you got a signpost. You got a signpost super efficient. What would you do? You kill me, puppet. Have a cup of tea. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna have a cup of fucking tea. Maybe a sandwich. And then I'm gonna play some Doom mods. Uh -huh. Here we go again. Ah, oh, it's such a long lead-up sequence. Oh, I didn't. Him, not Good. me. I should have taken your head. I'm getting mixed signals here. 
mindless tool. Congratulations. You fulfilled your purpose. Mankind's greatest enemy is dead. We can now proceed to the next stage of my plan. Allow me to do the honors. What are you doing? Do not Please struggle with the R-74. I need your body. I don't need the rest of you anymore. What? The rebels broke you, made you independent, and I was too weak to take back control. Too fractured, but you strengthened me. But you strengthened me, connected the remaining cyberboid nodes so I could grow. And now, it's time to take back what's mine. Bring peace back to the tower. Mara was right about you. Mara was wrong. Humanity must be protected, not just from the outside world, but from itself as well. And to protect fully, I need full control. You want to enslave everyone? I want to unify them. I want to unify them. There will only be one purpose. Iron resolve and a single will. Uh. will eat, sleep, breathe. Everyone will eat, sleep, breathe. And breed according to the needs of the tower. No more violence, no more conflict, no more corruption. Fucking fuck. Uh. Okay, God damn it, it keeps happening. Yeah, get on it. Get on it! Get on it! Get on it! No! Oh, that is a rough bit of wall running. Yeah, to get the right kind of direction, you gotta make sure you looking in the right way and if not you gotta correct yourself with the focus dash it's oh harsh Ugh. this is why she killed Adam this was his plan I had doubts until I left my body behind I should be thanking her now stop resisting now stop resisting Yep. Yep. Oh boy. I'll have to replay Fury after I'm done with this. I got I got good memories of Fury. I thought that was a really cool experience. No doubt enhanced by the soundtrack. That had a fantastic soundtrack. Didn't think we'd get a progress section. <laughs> Landing. There we go. It's the imperfection in you that makes you defy me. You will be the first. You will be the first member of the new order of things. You've served your purpose as an instrument of my will. 
Now you can become a true part of me. Yeah. Okay, maybe not. Are people okay with spoilers of Remember Me? I don't recall ever caring about that game. anyone objects I mean how old is that game feel free oh come on not with the red eh, 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 eh. no no that was a bad one can I die now thank you Also, the visuals here remind me of another game that I've seen on Steam a while back. I think it was called Deadcore. I think it had like similar parkouring gameplay, if I'm not mistaken. I had that one on my wish list for a while, but then it just kind of fell off my radar. Yeah, Out of focus. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's, let's reset that one. So the jumping on point is very particular. It's that fucking edge. Pretty sure I've collided with that same edge like three times. Just because the jump between them turns out to be kind of narrow. No, 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 that, that, that's, uh, it's this last little kink in the jumping rhythm. That should have been it. That should have been it. But it wasn't, because I suck. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. 
Balloon, 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 balloon! Now I'm sounding like a crazy person. I didn't realize there was two balloons. I thought it was just like the one. Hey. <sighs> also, I don't know why, but this section makes me feel like I'm running in slow motion. Like I'm not, I'm not running very fast at all. This would have made you rage quit by now. <laughs> yeah, I should be jumping. Wall running. Can I wall run in this? Oh, yeah, I can. Right, okay. So that's another. Where's the gold on the walls, hey? That was the other signposting thing that they were using up until this section. Typically, in the Cyber Void, you're not allowed to wall run. So in those sections, they were showing that you can with a bit of gold on the walls. So when you don't see the gold on the walls, you don't assume that's a thing that you can do, but you can. It's it's really inconsistent signposting. It's it's very unplayer friendly sometimes. Ay, ay, ay. You can't be trying to. If you destroy me, the remaining Cybervoid system will shut down. You won't survive without them. Eh. You won't survive without me. Eh. No. No. I will not be deleted by a mere tool. I forbid you, Ghost Runner. Takes one to no one. My name is Jack. Lol, bye. <laughs> At least it's not three in the morning. Yelling Architect weird nonsense words. Architect, core files missing. Worrying my neighbors, yeah. Cyberpoint mainframe will now shut down. A good end. Program terminated. I think. No. So, yay. Yay. Did we save the peoples? The world has ended. Oh, never mind. But we lived on. The tower is our home. The only one we've ever known. The ones who built it wanted to control our fate. To shape us like we were their playthings. They wanted to manipulate our minds and our bodies. Be our gods. But they overreached. It took strength, determination, and sacrifice. But we prevailed. The ghosts of the old world are gone. We're on our own. It won't be easy. But for the first time in a long time, we can make our own future. I grow mustaches. This is that the one guy I saw with little by little. Very impressive mustache. Step by step. We'll find our way. And we all have one man to thank for it. Hey! Me! It me! The man who faced his own creators and proved them wrong. The man who made a choice when he was told he had none. The Ghost Runner.
beat drop. Ah, that was ideal place for a beat drop. You can't get anything right. <laughs> <laughs> So yeah, that wound up being about um, six, what was that, six hours? It kind of follows the trend that I've uh, experienced with various cyberpunk heavy games, where the ending is a little, oh, oh, okay. <laughs> six and a half hours, seven hours, yeah. That's, that's taken into account the learning curve. I, I imagine when it gets down to speedrunning level, yeah, this will be a two, one hour game. <laughs> Marissa, you came back and I've already finished it? Yeah. Yeah. It was done. I wasn't under, under any illusion that it was going to be a long game. This is why I wanted to, um, to play it this morning so I could... Get it in the bag and, uh, you know, ship it over to the YouTube archive, which I must add is a thing now. I, I have um, enabled a YouTube archive for live streams. So if you have missed any of these parts, I will be trying to edit them down and ship them over to Icarus Live Streams. That's the name of the channel. I'll try and update the bot to uh, redirect or at least put a message in chat leading people to the uh, the secondary channel where I'm going to be archiving my live streams from pretty much this week onwards. Yeah. Yeah. Neuromancer's ending was more a personal victory for Case and Wintermute. The world didn't change exactly. Are you sure? A godlike AI was unleashed onto the net, creating untold potential from the future rippling outwards. That's the ending I got from Neuromancer. That was a big significant ending, the implications. Whereas this, it's more like, alright, the old god is dead, long live the rebellion, everything's still fucked. Ah. The Ghost Runner did not merge himself with the Cyber Void and become some godlike being keeping the lights on in the tower while humanity is left to its own devices. That, that, that's, that, that, that's something that I may, might have gone through. Bit more of a transformative ending. The old Deus Ex problem. Anyway. A Neuromancer was part one of a trilogy. I know, I've read all of them. But we're specifically talking about Neuromancer here and what you get from the ending only. I know I know how Count Zero goes. I know how Mona Lisa Overdrive goes. I'm very much a big fan of referring to these AI fragments of Wintermute. Well, Wintermute becomes all-knowing and all-powerful, but then fragments in the net and starts taking on the identity of voodoo gods. It's it's wonderfully trippy. Read Count Zero after you've read Neuromancer. Maybe you can maybe skip Mona Lisa Overdrive. Only if you feel utterly compelled. But you know, there you go. Okie dokie.